Hello everyone, my name is Web Weaver, and welcome to Please for the Love of God YouTube Process the Damn Video, I beg of you! I don't want to do an emergency stream in the last, like, final seconds of the whatever time limit, and then be like, oh yo, what up? Video was done processing the moment you hit the live stream button, uh, even though it wasn't there for the entirety of the time. Um, we're gonna play Chie again? I feel like I want to actually win as Chie. Now remember, this is the cursed Chie with modified custom perks that we used for the, um, whatchamacallit, that we used for the, uh, you know, the perk tier list. That's the one. That's what I meant to say. And we're doing ill-fated. You can't stop me. He, he, he doesn't miss. Uh, we'll, we'll even do, uh... Do I really want to do this? Fuck it, we ball. We're gonna stack damage, maybe. <laughs> oh, come on! I could've- I, I clicked Chie. Everybody saw that. Everybody saw that that was Chie. We were all- we were all looking for Chie. They're gonna be looking for the chariot. Oh, god. Chie is the chariot, right? I didn't get her and Yosuke confused. It's Yosuke, right? Not Yusuke. Yusuke is the- oh, fuck. I hate- I, I hate how they're both called Yusuke and Yosuke. Yusuke and Yosuke? Ah. Uh, anyways. I... What What are we doing here? I don't know. Why, why on earth is is this what it is? I'm gonna reroll. Fuck it. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. We're gonna... I mean, I said we're gonna stack damage. We're gonna stack damage. Um, we'll take a point of knowledge just for fun. Just for funsies, you know. I mean, I'm gonna cast Enthrallment. I, I might as well. Maria is, uh, kind of disappointing. Uh, cause I highly doubt we're going to buy cigarettes. But hey, uh, if we get paranoid, then we lost three net reason. Uh, but that could win the game if we, like, you know, recovered to full, went down to the bottom, and then, like, needed one paranoid reason to survive, so we just stabbed Maria, you know, it is. Um, let's, let's not go down that train of thought. Second enemy, and then that's it. There's no compass here, so just, uh, knowledge, dexterity. We can do that, actually. We can do that pretty easily. And light source? I'm, I'm not gonna complain about that. I, I think, uh... I, I think we can realistically make something like that happen. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and take the schoolyard where we've got this weird ally thing going on right now. We might as well, right? Uh, very unlucky. Tis the season, I suppose, but I don't know. Kyrie's got the drip, though. Like, I love the ghost outfit, but I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll definitely use the Halloween outfit on the Halloween episode, of course, but like, you know. Um, just take the EXP, it'll, it'll make life a little bit easier. Botany, Eels, Coma, Wordless Ward. So here's the thing. We have five Charisma. So, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I actually don't want to do Kana immediately. I want to level up and put two points into charisma. Oh my god, what am I doing? This is the worst strategy of all time. It's one of them. Uh, I'll tell you that much. By the way, I did the uh, the normal version of the Criterion dungeon last night. And I want to say, normal hits like a fucking truck, alright? Like, let me just be real with you. Ritual robe. Shadow shroud. Give me leadership i'll take that actually that's pretty nice um but what was i gonna say oh i have no idea but uh yeah i did the i did the criterion dungeon last night with a friend um my gear broke and we had to call it uh we didn't get past the first boss which is probably a pretty universal experience i would imagine it's uh, a very difficult boss to fight Oh yeah, we rolled a 99. That's right. We're on, um, our stats don't matter, by the way. Uh, did anybody remember that? We're on ill- we're on ill-fated? Why- why did I do this? Uh, do- hmm. I do want the compass. So we're gonna just, uh, it ruin the entire game right now. We're gonna throw the entire game. 
we're gonna throw the entire game. I'm gonna buy a camera on Copium. I'm gonna grab a, a couple of bricks with a reasonable amount of doom. And uh, we're just gonna go in here, and then we're gonna die to reason loss, and then we're actually gonna play Chie. That's, uh, that's the real, the real shit, as it were. But uh, Chie doesn't have a, a cool costume like this, though. So that is true. But yeah, the uh, the new dungeon hits like a fucking truck. Like, the, the first adds pull that you do, you're gonna die because your tank is gonna... Well, I actually, you know what, I won't spoil anything. Some people might not have had the chance to do the Criterion dungeon yet. But uh, the variant dungeon's really fun. Like, the variant dungeon is just enjoyable. And very, like, it's a very novel concept for a Final Fantasy dungeon, although I suppose it would be more akin to something you'd see in, like, World of Warcraft, where you have, like, a bunch of, like, branching paths and the dungeon is one big thing. I will say one of the things I was a little bit sad about is that at least the route that I went, you couldn't go any other route. Because, like, what I remember from watching, like, some of those really good, like, World of Warcraft videos is when somebody was doing the dungeon, they'd say, oh, you can either go this route or you can go this route, and then after a certain point, you can, like, branch off and do another route and then do, like, the final boss or something or just end the dungeon early. So maybe we took a route that ended the dungeon early. I got ending six. But uh, it's a really neat idea, actually. It's a, it's a really neat idea. We'll take the, uh, Doom. Yeah, that's fine. But it's actually a really neat idea. I love the variant dungeon. I can't wait for the, the other one. And I'm gonna probably play it solo quite a bit. Because it's just, it's just fun. Like, it's just, it, it's just a fun little thing. It's not difficult at all, no. It's very easy. But the mechanics that I've seen so far are very interesting. And, um, it's just a fun thing. Uh, I did ending six with a friend. I'm probably gonna do more of it later. Uh, the Criterion dungeon, on the other hand, uh, can go to hell. The, uh, we, we couldn't get past the first boss. It's incredibly difficult. And this is the normal version, by the way. There is a savage version that gives you a mount if you beat it. Um, and it's like, holy shit, it's hard. It's like, really, it's, it's really hard. Like, I'm not even joking. It's ridiculously hard. But, uh, now we go to Kana. Let's fucking go. But, uh, yeah, no, it's, uh... It, it, it's ridiculously hard. Like, I, I, I recorded... Unfortunately, what ended up happening is my, um... I accidentally had, like, a bunch of programs, uh, programs open, which hog RAM. So, they, um... Well, I think they're both reason, actually. I, I don't know. But, uh... I don't actually know how to resolve that one properly. Um, for ill-fated, that is. I, I don't know what the, both of the options do off the top of my head. But uh, I, I recorded, uh, but the thing is I had a bunch of programs that have dedicated RAM to them. Like a lot of dedicated RAM. I had Adobe open and I had Streamlabs open. So OBS was struggling. So like our first reactions are there, but the video quality is just absolutely horrible. But it was really fun, though. It was I, I, I'm gonna be, like, watching that in, like, five years and be like, ah, those were the good old days. We were naive back then, back when Criterion and Variant Dungeons were good. But, uh... Anyways, it, it's a very... I, I, I'm, I'm loving it. I'm absolutely loving it. I can't wait to dive back into it. I should have probably assumed... That's a luck check? I thought that would be, like, a charisma. But, uh, yeah, no, definitely, for, for sure, for real. Uh, you probably just want to do that. Maybe I should have done the panic attack, but, like, you can get, uh, you can get things from there, so. Like, you can get something truly evil there, which I think would be preferable. Also, we fought two enemies. What the hell was our second enemy? I was not paying attention. It was Shiro-san. Gotcha. And I can tell because we have two smokes. So, literally, enemy counter, top right corner. That's what Maria does. Um... Okay, so we're, like, actively fucking, like, dying, though. For real, for real. Okay, and now we're gonna spend even more Doom going to the schoolyard, and we're gonna get friends. We're gonna get friendship? We're gonna get friendship. <laughs> get her out of here. Friend? Friend? Friends! 4% doom, threaten them. Threaten them. Give them a little threaten.
That was not worth it, by the way. We're just having fun here. I probably should have rested again, but, uh, yo, what up? Let's go. No! I, I didn't pay attention to threat levels because I'm stupid. But yeah, no, the criteria on dungeons really cool. I can't wait to give that a bigger, uh, a better try. A bigger try? Um, I don't know what I was saying there. A bigger try? A beggar try? I got, I, bro is flabbergasted. <laughs> Flo is flabbergasted. <laughs> oh, God. I'm in shambles today. Listen, I ate something and I'm all messed up. Like, for real, for real. It's fine, though. It's completely fine. I'm just not gonna buy that food ever again. But, uh... Anyways, we're just hanging out. I, I really can't wait to do it, though. Like, I, I after I get this and the Halligan episode out, I'm gonna go straight back to doing that. And it's gonna be fun. I'll probably do the variant dungeon if uh, the squad's not around to go into the Criterion one. I don't know if I want to do it blind. Like, I feel like doing a dungeon blind is more acceptable than doing a savage fight blind, but the normal version of the Criterion dungeon is literally just like, hey, every boss is a savage fight and you have to beat them within a certain time limit. And it's like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Great subversion of expectations in the first, like, five seconds of the of the dungeon, though. And the variant dungeon's just cool. I, I like both of them. I, I Honestly, though, I would like for them to make, like, a, a normal dungeon that is sort of like a variant dungeon, if that makes sense. Like, multiple pathways to go, multiple endings, something that you have to do in duty roulette. That'd be so cool. They're never gonna do that, but I think it would be cool. Like, just at least one of them, so people would be like, ah, oh. so that, like... People in, like, five years could go, oh, fuck, it's the big dungeon. No. And then they can just bitch at Square Enix, and then in ten years they'll change it and make it a straight line like every other fucking dungeon in the game. Oh, but I, we stand variant dungeons. Anything that's not a straight line is so welcome. <laughs> Even if it is just, like, pick your straight line, I, I don't care. It, it's so welcome. Coma, ward, arms, ugh. Ugh moment. Fuck it, ball. I mean, we have two bricks, you know, so it's like, uh... Hold on one moment. Sorry about that, there was a mosquito. I also just, like, it landed on my keyboard, so I tried to whack it, and I hit a bunch of keys, so something might have changed. Pain. That's actually one of the things that you can pass. Like, I, I've said it a million times, it does just indeed work. We're gonna do this so we lose stamina. Because it says luck failed, but it doesn't actually show you the dice roll. Um... Which doesn't mean that it's not a skill check, because some skill checks don't show you the dice roll, but that one specifically is a threshold check, because this game is weird. Um, we can prob probably just take this, right? Can we actually do it like this? Yes, we can. What the hell? We should be able to guarantee killer and only take one stamina damage. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I mean, we don't miss any... We're not gonna talk about this ever again. We're not gonna talk about this, uh, this Stockchon fight ever. This Stockchon fight didn't happen. That's a little bit sus. That's a little bit sus, I will admit. But, uh... We're, we're gonna... It, it is indeed... Oh, hold on, I do have to... That is true. If my screen was smaller, it would make doing this easier. And honestly, this is a very niche skill to have, because there have been situations in the past where uh, we could have needed this. But yeah, despite being excited for um, the Variant Dungeon, the Criterion Dungeon, because I really want to do all the endings in the Variant Dungeon, and I really want to do um, all of the... I, I really want to beat the Criterion Dungeon and then try the Savage version. How is the Savage for... <laughs> like, what's messed up is that the normal Criterion Dungeon is, like, at least so far, like, entry-level Savage difficulty is how I would describe it. 
like, I would say that this, that the first boss in the Criterion dungeon is probably, like, Eric level. But, uh, yeah, I, I, it's probably, like, not Eric level, and it's just, like, the first mechanics are Eric level, and then it just repeats those mechanics until you kill it. That's what I would assume. But if it's, like, a full, like, easy savage fight, and then there's three of them in a row, B to B, same instance, holy shit, for four people? I'm loving it. I, I'm, I'm out here. I'm out here living. We, we living. I, I want to do it so badly. But uh, despite that, I'm actually really excited about um, a game came out recently called Potionom po Potiona Potionomics. Uh, is that how you pronounce it? And uh, honestly, it's it looks so cute. And it's like a um, you're a potion seller, and you're uh, you're managing your um, buckley ball, um, and you're managing your uh, your potion shop. And there's also like a dating sim aspect to it as well, because of course there is. Um, and it just it looks so cute. It looks so adorable. It looks uh, it, it looks absolutely delightful. Uh, and I really want to play it. It's just there's. There's one review I saw, there's one review I saw of the game that is just so fucking funny. We're not, we're not gonna miss this, right? I'm gonna throw this, and then we're gonna do it like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, there's one review of the game that I saw that just made me lose it. Like, every, like, it was, like, the, I, let me see if I can find it. It should be at the top. I have the game in my cart. I, I really should just buy it. But I, I'm so worried about buying games because I just hope I, I'll just probably never play them. But it, it looks it, it looks good. But anyways, it's <laughs> one of the one of the reviews was uh oh here's a good one. Truly the Dark Souls of Potion Crafting Sims. Um, let's see, where, oh, okay, no, I can't, I can't find it at all, but, like, one of the first positive reviews for the game when the game came out a couple days ago was, I, <laughs> I hope they <laughs> encrypted the 3D models, <laughs> that's fucked, it is absolutely fucked. But yeah, no, Potionomics looks cute. Apparently it's been in the works for like five years. But, uh... Yeah, no, I, I kind of want to... I, I, I kind of want to buy it. It looks very good. We're going to take this. Or maybe this. Yeah, we're actually going to take Arcane Grasp. That's uh, a, a very fuck it we ball scenario. True and real. Do I want to try to do Dexterity? No, because we need to heal... Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do it like that. We're gonna do it like that, and then we're going to uh, we're just gonna chill out for a little bit. We're just gonna chill out for a little bit. We're just gonna hang out. Oh, we're we're screwed, by the way. There's no shot that we're gonna do this. We do have good combat though, but we would have to kill the boss if we wanted to avoid the sanity. So we're just not going to avoid the sanity. Um. So that would kill, because it's weak to blunt. Pretty interesting, actually. Lump of flesh is very nice, but that's not, uh, hello, dog. She do be going, uh, she do be going morb? She morbin? She morbin? We're about to mute, we're about to Emmerdale? She morbin? Yeah, she morbin. Look at her go. She's going goblin mode. Honestly, the mic should cut out most of it, but... You know. It's not, uh... Oh, do we check out the freezer? No, absolutely not. Oh, god damn it! I thought that that one was the stamina one. Is the middle one is stamina? You piece? Okay, this is good. We, we can just, we can just fight. Yeah, we, we can just go for it. What can we do here? We can take two, she goes down to 19. But there's no way for us to do 20. Yeah, so we'll, we'll just eat the lump of flesh. That's fine by me. 
Oh, it's look who it is. It, it's here who it is because, you know, the only thing you can see is the video game. Uh, we'll, we'll keep this for now. Just in case we want to get, like, desperation off of off on somebody. Unearthly suture? Do we have an injury? I don't think this does anything. Yeah, no, it, it didn't do anything. So that's fine. Must find a way to sneak through? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, so we didn't get a lot of doom here. Which is pretty good. Uh-oh. Wait, hold on, hold on. We're, we just win? We just win? We just do it big? We just do it big? You'll love to see that. You'll love to see that. You do indeed. Just do it big. That was branded, wasn't it? Oh, no. <laughs> no! You peace! Yeah, we'll just do it like this. Do I have quick thinking? No, I don't. So there's still a chance that we'd be able to do the dexterity thing. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neat. That's not neat. That's the opposite of neat. That's a, a sad moment. But yeah, I guess I'm looking forward to two things. A, uh, a cute potion game and uh, doing more Criterion Dungeon gaming. Now, honestly, I really should do reason here, but fuck it, we ball. Let's just get lucky. Aw, oh, fuck. Um, I mean, we could sell the... No, we can't. Oh, no. The consequences of my actions. <laughs> no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, shit. Um, so here's the thing. We, we can kill him. We can indeed kill him, but at what cost? We don't have paranoia. So it's not, we're not exactly looking, looking good here. So we could do this, he goes down to, to 20. <laughs> and then what? Then what do we do? Cause this guy will do like one. Maria will do like one. He can go down to 18 as a treat. That would actually work perfectly. Uh, go get, go get a mer- Oh, wait, 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 wait. We don't need to sacrifice Maria on the altar yet. We, we, we can still get that paranoia sacrifice. Just you wait. Um, we will back out. I just love the, the blood-splattered ghost costume. You peace! We have art knowledge, don't we? Allegedly. Um... I, I don't really think we can do anything about this, by the way. Like, we, we just kind of have to let it ride. And we will call the police, because we're going to fail the dexterity check no matter what. Um, so now we go to the monument and hope it's stamina, and if it's not, we lose the game. Okay. I can maybe work with this if you weren't a son of a gun because we don't have self-therapy, and even if we did, it wouldn't matter. So that's a shame. Um, so anyways, we take two reason here and die. We take two reason here and- oh fuck. Um, Uh-oh, that's Doom. I keep forgetting that's Doom. I don't have the, the events memorized. That's okay, though. And here's the thing. Since you have two videos to watch from yesterday, we're not going to do another run. I, I, I have done enough. Wait, 80%, I was about to say. I was about to say. Oh, what? Oh, no! <laughs> the consequences of my actions? No! But that's not- okay, hold on, they do need to go punch. Alright, Maria, go get them. Maria, damn. So that's gonna do- this is four to five, so that's gonna do nine, so we're good. Maria kinda hit differently, though, damn. I wonder if you can send, um, Emmy and the otaku guy and Aiko's friend to go fight for you. I don't actually know if you can. 
Because if you could, then they would have a use. They would do like one to two damage. Which is still not worth it, either of them. But that would make them better than uh, literally non-existent. Uh, it was you. Because we had two cigarettes when I beat you to death. <laughs> <laughs> What a, what a horrible thing to say. Okay, there we go. Um, and here's the thing, this run didn't count. I wanted to play as Chie anyways. So thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Have a good one. Uh, there were two episodes yesterday, so if you only saw the live stream or you only saw the video, you've got something you can watch. You've got something you can catch up on. Uh, in case you're wondering what this color palette is, it's literally just haircuts, but I turned vibrancy and saturation up. Uh, and tweak the colors a little bit. Like, there's a little bit more red in some areas, and there's a little bit more, like, green in others, I think. Um, here are the... Here are the settings. Right, right here. Did a... did a... did a few things right there. So there... there you go. I wonder if you can make this bigger? Oh, you can! There we go. There's all the settings. Um... But yeah, no, it's actually really cool. There's a lot of neat color palettes here. Uh, like, most of them look pretty close to vanilla, but there's, like, significant differences to them. So, like, uh, Gardner is, like, more desaturated, I guess. Um, there's a really good one. I think it's, uh, whatchamacallit? O Occultation looks really good, too. It looks like, uh, like ch cherries, I guess you could say. Um, but a really good one is uh, actually Curse Slap. Is it Curse Slap? No, there's one that's, like very mint colored and i'm trying to figure out which one that is I, I you're gonna get the color palette changed pretty quick here so i do apologize for that but a lot of them just look really nice riverside incident looks really good blood dawn oh blood dawn looks so good here normally this is like a gray like a really dark gray but it's green now oh, absolutely goaded faraday is it faraday i was thinking oh zr i hadn't seen this one yet that one looks great look at this there, there are some really cool things you can do with reshade in this game for color palettes. Neon also looks pretty good. Uh, now it's not deep gold. Old print looks goaded as well. Old print usually is like one of the better color palettes. But uh, yeah, anyways, it's a, it's a pretty good... Um, maybe it was Mythos that I was thinking about. But yeah, no, it's, it's, it's very good. Like, even Monolith doesn't look that bad. It's actually less, like, bright, so it's less of, a, of an assault on the eyes. But yeah, anyways, uh, thanks. That's a little bad. Seaside is always a little bad, though. Uh, and even Standard has, like, a hint of green here. This is just the default color palette. Anyways, thank you for watching. Stay safe out there. Uh, there should be a Halligan adventure later tonight if there's not. Um, oops. Stay safe out there. Have a good one. Bye.